a little tip when um, modeling with primitives it doesn't quite matter if the object doesn't represent the real item in reality after all I'm only making a picture so if I were to say place my inner stringers and not bother to break them so that they're um, not not break them so they're not so they're not overlapping with one another it's really not going to matter in fact it's going to be a plus in computer terms because what it means is I'm gonna have less faces when it comes to rendering this image out and the less faces you have the faster the machine can render the image so modeling in a way which is going to limit the amount of faces you're going to have in your drawing is always a bonus